Hello everyone, I'm Hartford HealthCare's Tina Verona. Thank you so much for watching this Facebook Live edition. I'm happy to be joined by Dr. Peter Yu, he's the physician in chief of the Hartford HealthCare Cancer Institute on what is an exciting new day, Dr. Yu. We are here in Manchester at the grand opening of the new Manchester Cancer Center. So thank you for joining us, first of all. Oh, my pleasure. And how are you feeling? This is a, an you exciting know, I, day. You know, I've been here just about three years now. I would say this is probably the most exciting day I've had at Hartford HealthCare. This is really Really a tremendous uh, amount of effort that's gone into opening this new center in Manchester. It's really our, our biggest um, splashes uh, <laughs> uh, 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 project that we've done, and it really will really transform healthcare for patients with cancer and their families in this community. Yeah, and east of Hartford, so this will be access to care very close to home. How was Manchester selected as a center for the cancer center? Well, well, Manchester, in, in many ways, is, is a perfect place to locate because it's right off of Highway 84, just a really only a few minutes from downtown Hartford. Um, so it's very accessible. We can bring our physicians and our resources out here very, very easily. Um, so it was not very difficult. Um, at the same time, you know, while distance-wise is not very far, um, driving into downtown Hartford and looking for parking uh, it is really difficult. Uh, and so by coming out here, this is really central to the Manchester community. It extends up 84 towards Tallinn. Uh, you can go north and south of here to Enfield. Uh, so really, it was a very, very central location for us. And, and a really a spectacular, beautiful state-of-the-art building here. And it really feels like a home environment here. Tell us a little bit about the design and some of the cancer services that are going to be offered here. Well, first thing, the first thing you notice is, is this is not a hospital, so we're not in a hospital. And we've been doing this successfully uh, for several years now at Hartford, saying, you know, the hospitals are not the center of the universe. They are not where patients feel comfortable. It's a very scary environment in the hospital. Most cancer treatments does not require being in the hospital. And so there was really no reason to, to build it in the hospital. It made much more sense to bring it out into the community, close to people's homes. It made it important for us to make it feel like a warm, nurturing environment to heal. Uh, a lot of space, open space, a lot of lighting, natural lighting, uh, room for the patients but also their families to be with them. Um, these are all elements that we designed into this building. And, and beautifully, done so beautifully. Now the partnership with Memorial Sloan Kettering Cancer Alliance, of course Hartford Healthcare, was the founding charter member of the Alliance. How will that play a role here in Manchester? So we're having our Memorial Sloan Kettering partners coming up on Friday. Very good. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Two to days from now building. to come out here and visit. Um, that actually is, is part of the relationship. So part of the relationship is, is that Memorial Sloan Kettering comes in here and certifies our sites. So they look at our facilities, they make sure the state of the art, uh, the pharmacy is up to date, uh, we are adequately staffed, uh, and really as if it was in New York City. Uh, so they have that same stringent requirements. And so they're coming up here this week to look at this place. Uh, and once they sign off on it, uh, then we will be able to do our shared activities, especially our clinical trials in this building. And speaking of taking a look at this place, let's take a look at this place. We're on the third floor here of the Cancer Center, and we're actually walking into the infusion area, right? That's right. Um, which is all private rooms. Tell us a little bit about the So this is the center. this is the top floor. Mm -hmm. And on this floor is where patients will receive chemotherapy treatments mm -hmm. uh, as part of their cancer treatment. And so um, it's kind of cloudy outside, um, but there's an atrium here with natural skylighting to bring the light in. Um, it's a very open space um, where the nurses are central here mm -hmm. and can see all the patients. But each of the patients have their own individual, you know, little Private areas. private areas where we'll take a look at one of them but they can be closed off to give privacy um, but the nurses are right there so they see what's happening uh, it's large enough to have a comfortable chair our patients don't need to be in bed so there's and even a family with, member to, to yeah, join them exactly room for family members um, Wi-Fi uh, television screens things to occupy them here while they're here um, and each one of these is an individual we have 15 of these individual um, spaces uh, for patients 
Um, and we also have uh, an outside uh, garden area so that uh, a lot of times patients can get up and walk around. They don't have to stay in the space. Mm -hmm. uh, they can move around, move outside, be with their family. And even the color scheme, it's great when you walk in. And I love the words of encouragement um, on the walls here to some of the sayings. It's really nice. What are some of the services, cancer services, that are going to be provided here um, at the Cancer Center? Well, certainly any, any chemotherapy type infusions, mm -hmm. that includes now immunotherapy and more mm -hmm. advanced uh, type treatments. Uh, our research staff is, uh, has an office here and they're gonna be on site uh, for the clinical trials, looking at the cutting edge drugs and studies that we do with Memorial Sloan Kettering. Uh, we will have other services, genetic counseling uh, for patients who have a fa strong family history of cancer, uh, dietitians, um, other kinds of psychosocial support uh, will be available here. We have our physicians downstairs on the second floor uh, and also nurse practitioners on the second floor and up here as well. Really state-of-the-art facility and all the care under one roof which allows for greater access to the people living here at East of Hartford. Dr. Peter, we thank you so much for joining us. We appreciate it and congratulations on the facility. And of course, as always, thank you for watching. I'm Hartford Healthcare's Tina Verona. We'll see you soon.